What's going on, you guys? Today, I'll be talking about my 2019 Dodge Charger GT. Ooh, she looks so mean right there. Ooh. All right, today, I'll be going through. It's really bright out here. I'm in Arizona. I don't know if you know about this weather, but boy, I'm talking about straight heat. But today, we'll be talking about all the little stuff I did to it to make it look mean, you know what I'm saying? It look kind of good right now, if you can see on the back. Yeah, we'll get into it. So, right now, before we get into it, y'all, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment. You know, share some, share this to some people so they can, you know, get their junk looking a little bit meaner. I mean, mine's not the best. I just started, but let's get right into it. Let me show you what I did. All right, just from looking at the front of it, you can tell it looked a little more mean and a little more like lower to the ground just because this front splitter, this front splitter right here is hydro dipped in carbon fiber. It comes on the side. It's not perfect but it comes off a little bit. I don't know if you can see that. It comes off a little bit. It's not perfect, but for $160, I got this front splitter. It makes the car look a little more mean. If you see that, bro, look at this. So when I first bought this car, when I first bought this car, I thought this was like a sticker. But if you look close enough, bro, that is the paint, bro. I need to get this hood repainted, but that's the front splitter. I supposed to have two splitter bars, but they still haven't came in yet. I got two to three days shipping and it's been three weeks. But the next thing you notice on this car, when you're first looking at it, is the yellow that stands out. So I got this little, I designed this myself. It's supposed to be Bumblebee. So that was the theme I was going with, black and yellow. So Bumblebee, you know, whatever. But I also painted my brake calibers. I did that myself. It's only $30. Bought the spray paint, bought the utensils and stuff, and sprayed that myself. It's looking pretty clean, I just washed her up. So, when you come around the back, you see if she look a little, she look a little thick back here, because of the things I did to it, she make, make it look a little more mean, a little more thick in the back, you know what I'm saying? All right, so first thing we'll get into, Please don't look at this. You're gonna piss me off if you say something. Anyway, so the first thing we go get into is this wicker bill that we put on here. Makes the car look mean as fuck. I like it a lot. This wicker bill, it was hella easy to put in. You really drill holes into your real spoiler. I think it was eight holes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep, so you drill eight holes. If you look in there, there's rivets in there that hold this. So, and it's pretty it's pretty firm. It's pretty firm, it's not going anywhere. So that was 115, I think. So 115, you can make the back of your car look hella mean, as you can see. All right, so we're gonna get into the way I make my tail lights. The way I make my tail lights look sharp on the edges. As in right there, right there, right here, right here, there, there, and there, there. So if you look close, you can't really tell, but if you look hella close, this is a sticker that goes over the back, makes the car look hella mean. Here, let me start it up for you so you guys can see what it looks like on. I mean, you can pretty much tell, but we're just gonna turn it on. Let me lock it first. Yeah, I didn't get my A. The exhaust is coming. I'm not gonna play with them. The exhaust is coming, but as you can see, it makes the back look mean and aggressive. At night, it looks hella, I'll show you. I'll put the one at night, how it looks at night right there. But as you can see at night, it looks hella mean, hella aggressive. In the daytime, you can still see it, but it just looks way more mean at night. Next thing we got is this diffuser. This diffuser is sexy AF. If you see this, this is the hydro dipped, hydro dipped diffuser. And it has the, I don't know what the hell those are called, but it makes it like, it makes the car look like it sits a little lower and it makes it look sexy. So, that's the diffuser right there. Let me get on this side. That's the diffuser. The next thing I'm getting is my 
um, my tips and my exhaust done. That's going to be, I think I'm going to get, uh, I'm not going to tell you what I'm going to get yet, but I'm going to get something on there to make it look sexier. But, yep, that's the back. On the sides, I'm not the best. This is my first time doing it, so you can see it looks a little, uh, but I got these blacked out on the side. You can see there's a scratch right here. Fuck, I'm fucking my car up. But those are blacked out back and the front. Blacked them out. They look hella good. My baby is glistening today. I better stop playing my girl. So I do already have a name for my car. You can see how blacked out the side right there. I do already have a name for my car. Her name is Megan. Yes, I'm talking about Megan the Stallion. Yeah. Yeah. Fat, as you can see right here. So that's why I named her Megan the Stallion. Because the back look sexy. That's my favorite part of the car so far, the back. Because I, I feel like I put the most into the back. So that's my favorite part of the car right now. But we're going to go ahead and go inside. And I'm going to show you what I did to the inside. We open the door. Sit inside her. You see, just look like a regular, regular schmegular. You know what I'm saying? Like a regular, regular car. So we hit that. Ooh. Now you can see the galaxy when you hit the, when you hit the, when you turn the phone, you see the galaxy, the little remote. You turn the brightness up a little bit so you can see it better. There you go. You can see the stars better. I did literally everything on my car I've done myself and that's how I'm gonna try to keep it. I'm trying to, I'm not trying to have to bring it to a shop. Okay, except for the exhaust, but everything else, I feel like I wanna do myself. So I literally had to do all this myself. I was gonna make a video about it, but I'm slacking, okay? Just call me a slacker. But from this angle, it looks pretty good. I got them. Most people don't do them on the sides right here, but I was like, I'm gonna be different. And as you can see in the middle, I don't know if you can see it. It doesn't look that good, but I try to make like a galaxy swirl. I tried, I tried to do something different, but I really like it. People get in my car at night. They're like, what the hell? They did not expect that. Yeah. So I did this for, I think it was 80 bucks, 90 bucks on Amazon. You can get the kit. And then it took me like two days to get it done actually. So, cause you have to take out the whole roof. You gotta go poke hella holes in it, glue them down put it back together, put it in the car, do functional checks. You got to take the lights out, all of that. So yeah, if you want to do that, if you want me to make a video about this, I really would, but it will be on someone else's car because I already got it in mind. So if you want to make a video about it, just let me know. I'll, I'll get it for y'all. You know, Just show you how it's done to make it look as pretty as mine. But I didn't do anything to the inside. That's it. That's all I did to the inside. Ah. Uh, so I don't know, I'm more of a, I want the outside to look mean as, mean right now. I want the outside to look mean, and then I'm gonna get into making the inside look good. I know you're supposed to go from the inside out because this is most of the time, like you spend is in the car, not on the stand on the outside or looking at it. You're supposed to, you know, make it look good. Yeah, but that's all I've done to my car so far. I'm gonna go back out here, just give you one last look around for my 2019. Dodge Charger GT. That's all I got right now. I'm gonna put the total, I'm gonna go over the prices one more time. So, the blacked out front, back, all sides, that was $26. To get your uh, brake colors painted, do it yourself, I spent like $40, I think, I believe. I'm right, right here, the real amount. Um, front splitter, $160. Shit looks mean AF. I made that, I don't know, you can do that or not, but I made that, that was like 40 bucks. Um, go around to back, back and back, back and back. Okay, so the rear diffuser, I think that was 180. The wicker bill was 116, 115, 15, 115. And then the tail light decal was, I believe, Fucking like 30 something dollars. I also have another decal I didn't put on it yet, but it's gonna black out all of that, the white and red. It's gonna black it out so the whole back will just look black. Um, and then the lights on the inside. I don't know if they're still on, let me see. 
The lights on the inside. This is daytime though, but the lights on the inside is gonna be eighty dollars if you do it yourself. That's it for the rest of this video. Um, if you liked it, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, join the family, whatever. This is like the first car video I did. Um, if y'all messing with it, I'm gonna do hella more because that's why I haven't been recording the stuff I did to my car, like the front splitter, all that good stuff. Because I don't know if y'all gonna like it or not. So this is my first video I'm gonna put in there of the car. If y'all like it, you know, fuck with it. But that's it. It's Jew. Ain't no Joe. Be breezy. I forgot how to do the outro, bro. I haven't made a video in a minute. Oh, get off my dick. Oh, bye.